to another class on arithmetic progression and geometric progression. Now, in this aspect, we'll be looking at the AP first. Now, see the first question here. The first question says, given the sequence 5, comma 1, comma minus 3, then what, what is the 20 term? Now, we now need to solve this by pressing your mode, then your vector. Don't, don't forget, you go to start. And start is number three. So, if you want to do AP and GP, you start for it. Now, you are going to use number two for AP, but we use number three, and we use number two for AP, and we use number six for GP. Now, let's start AP first, then we are still coming on GP. Now, for this, we'll now try to insert all the values here inside this place. Don't forget, this is the first term, this is the second term, and this is the third term. So press the first term, second term, and third term that we are given. Then go to the top here. Yeah? Then come to the front of the one year. Now the first term in the question given is 5. So press 5 and press equals to. Second term is 1. So press 1 and press equals to, as you can see. There's the first term, which is the value is 5. The second term, the value is 1. And the third term, the value is minus 3. And press equals to. What we have on the calculator is like this. You have X and you have Y. We use X to save for the term, and we use Y to save for the values of those terms. And that is what you have on your calculator. Now, after inserting what you are given, you will press your AC. The first question says, which, what is the 20th term? Then press that 20. Then press Shift 1. You notice they start here. So when you press Shift 1, you go to Reg. When you get to work, they, they ask us to find the value of the 20 term. And that means, what do we use to denote value here? That's why. So that's why you are going to press the Y here, which is 5. Then press the cost 2. And the answer for the 20 term is, the 20 term is minus 71, according to the question. Now, press AC. The next question says, which term will be minus 75? Which term? So press that minus 75 given, then press shift 1, go to reg. Now which term? Don't forget, what do we use to denote term? That's x. So your x is 4. So press equals 2. And that is 21st term. Can you see? So 21st term will give us minus 75. And the term, that will, uh, the, 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 the 20th term is what? Is minus 75. So press AC. Let's get to the second question. The second question says, if you are given this sequence, find A, B, and C. Don't forget, this one is the first time, this is the second time, this is the third time, this is the fourth time, and this is the fifth time. Now, let's go and insert. You press your mode. You go to your start. Use the number two for AP. But in this case, you will only insert the value given. Like, we are not given second time, third time, fourth time. You will not insert it. We are going to insert the first time. That's 1. So I was the value for the first time. That's 8. Can you see? We have 1 here. We have 8 here. Then come back here again. Another value given is the fifth time. So press 5. So instead of me to press second time, third time like that, no. Because we are not given second time, third time. So the next one we are given is fifth time. So press 5. Come to the front of the 5. And what's the value of the fifth time? That's 20. So press 20 and press equals 2. Now, press AC. Now, we have to find second time. So press 2. Then press shift and press start. Press your reg. Now, the value of the second term. So, which one denotes for the value? Don't forget why is for the value. And that's why. Press equals to. That shows for A is 11. If you don't want to waste your time, just press backward direction. Delete 2. Press 3 there. That's for B. Because it's third term. So, press equals to. That's 14. Press backward direction. Delete 3 and press 4. For the fourth term. Press equals to. That's 17. And that's why the answer is 11, 14, and 17. Now, press this. Let's get to the next one. Next question says, The 6th term and the 13th term of an AP is 0 and 14 respectively. Find the first 4th term. The first 4th term, it means the 1st term, 2nd term, 3rd term, and the 4th term. That's what we are asked to find. The first 4 terms of an AP. So now, press your mode, press your start, 
you press your number two, which is for AP. Now, you only insert what you are given. We are given six stamp and we are given 13 stamp. Don't forget, it says six stamp and 13 stamp are dash respectively. And what is the value of the six stamp? That's zero. And 13 stamp is what? It's 14. Press the cost two. It said six stamp and 13 stamp are zero and 14 respectively. Then press AC. When you press AC, they ask us to find the first four stamp. The first stamp is one. So press shift five and shift one rather. Shift one. So go to your reg. We are looking for the value, so that's why we have y. Then press equals two. Can you see that? You have it to be minus 10. So the first time is minus 10. You don't need to press anything. Just go here and delete one. Press two for the second time. And that's minus eight. Press back on here. Delete this and press three. And press equals two. This one is minus six. Come to this. Press delete and press four. And press equals two. This one is minus four. So this is the first four time, which is minus 10, minus 8, minus 6, and minus 4. Now, let's get to the next question. Next question says, if you are given this sequence, we are asked to find the common difference. Though it is obvious, this kind of question, you don't need to use calculator to solve, because common difference means 8 minus 5, that's 3, 11 minus 8, that's 3, 14 minus 11, that's 3. But I want to show you how to do this on the calculator in case you are given a complex, in case you are not given sequence, in case you are given something like this, 6 time and 13 time are dash. So you cannot find the common difference here straight up. But we can use calculator to find it straight up in case you are not given the sequence. So press your this, press your start, which is number 3, go to AP. Now, we are given the first time, second time, third time. I may not insert everything. So the first time here is 5. Second time is 8. Next one is 11. So press AC. So you can see that I don't include the fourth time because even if it is 2, you can insert out of the 4. It will still do the word, the calculation. Now, when you have this, we have to find the common difference. You press your shift 1. Don't forget, we still go to your VAR. And your common difference is B, which is 2. Now, can you see? So, we, when you press B, your B is what? It's 3. This is the common difference. And if you can see, it is the common difference. Now, as you are asked to find the common difference of this sequence now, you cannot solve it straight up like that. All you need to do is press your mode, go to start, then go to your AP. Don't forget, you are given the 6th star, and we are given the what? The 13th star. And those values are 0 and 14. So, 6 times is 0, and the 13th time is 14. So, press AC. So, if I'm asked to find the common difference now, I'll just press Shift 1, go to red, the B, press equals 2. As you can see, the common difference is what? It's 2, which is obvious from the sequence. So, I don't need to solve for all this before I get my common difference if I'm using the calculator. That's minus 8 minus minus 10. If you check it very that's minus 8 plus 10, which gives us what? 2. That is how to do it on the calculator. And lastly, which uh, we are asked to find the sum of this sequence, the first 20 term, the first 20 term. We are asked to find the first 20 term of this sequence. Now, this is what I'll be doing. I have two methods in finding the sum of 